Get ready, because I'm about to debunk your videos once and for all. Oh, goody! I can't wait to hear what you have to say. Let's start with this, Anita. We don't have a problem with violence against women in video games. For every time in a video game that you have to kill a woman, I can show you ten times that you have to kill a tentacled Nazi extra-dimensional alien mutant Fahuva God from Mars. That doesn't mean that we have a violence against Fahuva God's problem, does it? Boom! Debunked! I am sorry, I'm not sure if I cashed you correctly. What you just said makes no sense whatsoever. Tentacle Monster God? It's almost as if you're trying to deny that men get killed in video games just as much if not more than women do. Yes, I do not deny that you get to kill monsters in video games, but you know what else you can kill? Humans. And those humans can be men. Let me ask you this question, have you ever played Call of Duty, or Assassin's Creed, or even Grand Theft Auto V where you get to torture a man for information? But I assume you never held a controller in your life, and when you looked at one, you must have thought it must have been a double-headed dildo for some lesbian woman with her partner to shove it in their assholes. <laughs> So as some of you may know, I'm a fan of Devil's Bird Pig 69 and- Oh look! The escape mental patient from Arkham Asylum! Man, prison can really change a man, can't it? And as it turns out, recently he's been bombarded with docs on his video, Join the Egalitarianism Movement Now. The reason for this is that some old dude- I know he's not in his 20s, that's for sure. Wow. How unoriginal can you be? Oh yeah, I'll just photoshop an image by just drawing some squiggly lines and put a fedora hat on him because hell, it's just funny that MRAs are fat white men with fedoras and I'm sure my audience will laugh, just like on how Adam Sandler movies are funny because they contain deers licking poop. But don't you dare make a feminist look like a bra burning fat lesbian that never shaves her armpits and pretty much hate men. Well, I can do the exact same thing, but even better, allow me. This is what your original avatar looks like. This is what happens when I feel so fucking bored that I want to make an MRA out of you. Sure, it's not the best, but I think I made my point. And this is you with a piece of shit on top of your head. And if I had the tools, I would do a lot more. <laughs> So the trailer starts off by looking like a ripoff of Ice Age, and we're about to have one of the worst puns of history. When you don't fit in, life can be a real bear. No, I was wondering if the guy voicing over the trailer was, you know, looking at the script, and he was like, I have to make this shitty ass pun? Whew. I'm gonna need a lot more alcohol, you know?